from the mementos of the English martyrs and confessors for every day of the year by Henry Sebastian Bowden. July 14th, the law eternal. Venerable Richard Langhorn, layman, 1679. In spite of the penal statute forbidding Catholics to follow the law, he had risen to eminence in that profession, while at the same time he was known as a zealous Catholic. For this reason, he was impeached by Oates as a ringleader in his pretended plot. He defended himself with great ability, proved an alibi against Oates' statement as to where he lodged for the plot, but all in vain. He was condemned and drawn to Tyburn, July 14, 1679. In his printed speech, he declares his allegiance to the king, his innocency of the plot, and his sinfulness of treason. He then continued, quote, I take it to be clear that my religion alone is the cause for which I am accused and condemned. I have had not only a pardon, but also great advantages as to preferments and estates offered me in case I would forsake my religion, own myself guilty, and charge others with the same crime. By God's grace, I have chosen rather this death than charge others against the truth. Great as an exponent of human law, he was greater still in sealing with his blood his adhesion to the eternal law of God. With the words, into thy hands I commend my spirit, he went to his reward. <laughs>